welcome to prayer half hour. Amen. Amen. It is time for us to pray. Invite your family members. Let's pray to God. God is waiting to hear your voice. Amen. 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 Today we have also my wife, Pastor Yemi, um, is going to pray for us as we start. Amen. Amen. Let Amen. us pray. Yes. Our Father in heaven, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we glorify your name for counting us among the living today. Thank you, Father. Father, accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. We are forever grateful, Lord, because yes, Lord. you've been so kind to us. Mm -hmm. Father, take the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. We are gathered to pray. Father, we pray. That your Holy Spirit will teach us how to pray today in Jesus' Amen. name. We pray, Father, that we shall not pray and miss, Lord. Amen. Father, Lord God Almighty, we pray that you grant us unction, Father, this day in the mm. name of Jesus. Amen. And whatever we decree here on earth, Father, you decree in heaven in the name Amen. of Jesus. We pray that we shall not knock in vain, Lord. Amen. We shall not seek in vain, Lord. Amen. We shall not ask in vain, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father, for answered prayers. Oh, thank you, Jesus. For we pray it in Jesus' name. Name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a wonderful privilege to be able to talk to the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Today we want to pray for every door. We want to pray against every door of impossibility. Every door of impossibility. That's, that sounds, I mean, very striking because we perceive in our spirit that a lot of us are knocking at doors that are not opening. Mm. But today, we want to assure you by the grace of God that the God that answers prayer is here. Mm. Amen. Amen. The God that opens and no man can shut is here. Amen. The man that shuts and no man can open is here. Amen. I want to give you an assurance that at the end of this prayer session, you are going to experience possibilities. Door will open for you. Amen. And before we go, in, go, go on, I want you to just mark this this date in your calendar between the day between 16, 17, and 18 of September. You know, we want to invite you specially, be our special guest, please, to this year's Kingdom Possibility Conference. Kingdom Possibility Conference and now our annual thanksgiving service you know uh, the, the lord has brought us this far and want to give him thanks mm -hmm. please join us as we thank god and please be part of this three days program kingdom possibility conference and we are we want to we want you to believe god for some impossibilities that will be made possible amen in the mighty name of jesus amen. hallelujah so we, we will now begin to continue to pray and um, let us first of all thank God because we have a God that answers prayer. You, we have a God that nothing is too hard for Amen. him. Okay. Look at the book of Jeremiah, for example. Let's look at Jeremiah chapter 32 verse 27. Jeremiah 32 verse 27 says, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? Hey, what a what a what a promise! What what's a confidence we have in God that we can come and pray to the God whose who's nothing is difficult for Him to do. I want to assure you, based on this word of God, Jehovah Yahweh, He said nothing. Is too hard for him. Amen. For this, for this, let's first of all thank God for Father it. Lord, we thank you. Let us we thank God for we have a God there's nothing that every impossibility is made possible with him. There is Lord, nothing God, that is hard for him. Mm. Oh, he made Father, impossibility possible. He made impossibility possible. He made impossibilities possible. He made impossibilities. Jehovah Jireh. He made impossibility possible. Oh yes. He made impossibility possible. He made impossibility possible. He made impossibility possible. I speak uh, that song into your life. Amen. Every impossible doors, every doors that look so impossible that you have been knocking at. Mm -hmm. I don't know how long you have been knocking at those doors. 
I don't know the kind of door it may be. No matter how hard it is, you have come to a God that nothing is too hard for. Yes, Lord. The God that makes impossibility possible. Is the one that we have come to meet tonight. Is the one that we have come to meet this hour. Your own will be possible. Amen. Your own will not be too hard for Amen. him. I say your own will not be too hard for Amen. him. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Look at what God says in the book of Genesis chapter 28. Genesis chapter 8, 28 verse 14. He says also your descendants shall be as the dust of the earth. He said, you shall spread above to the west and to the east, to the north and to the south. And in you and in your seed, all the families of the earth shall be blessed. Can you see a God that makes all things possible? There is nothing he cannot do. This our God is just too much. See, Mark 9, 23. He says, and Jesus says in the book of Mark chapter 9, verse 23, he said, Jesus said to him, if you can believe, all things Absolutely. are possible to him who believe. The question is, can you believe? Can you believe? So we are going to pray for one thing, for a heart of belief. Mm. The heart of faith in God. Amen. That that thing, Lord, I believe. Amen. I believe in you, Lord, and it mm. shall be done. Amen. Father, we Father, pray, O oh Lord, Almighty, Lord, for a heart of Father, belief. Lord, Almighty, Remove unbelief from our hearts. Some of us Father, have believed Lord, that Almighty, that door cannot open. Ah, Lord Almighty, give us Father, a new heart. A heart of, of Jesus. A heart that believes. Believe. Remove Lord, unbelief Lord, from Almighty, our hearts. Give it to us in the Remove name of unbelief Jesus. from we to, believe in Jesus' true, name. We pray. Amen. Some of you you have, you have believed so much that look. Look, let me just stay with this situation. I don't think I use I'm too old to get married. Oh, I, I've been I've been knocking at the door of marriage for all these years. It's not coming. The man is not coming. Or the woman is not coming. Because it's not about man, a woman alone. It's also it happens to men too. I am going to tell you, I want to tell you that that door can uh, can, can can still be open. Amen. Just believe. Man. Many of you have believed that, look, I'm too old to get a child. I want to tell you that womb is opening. Amen. Just if you can believe. Amen. Christ says, just, said, if you can believe. Mm. All things. Yes, is the condition is, the problem is with us, not with our God. With God, all things are possible. Yes, Amen. Amen. I don't know the kind of door you are knocking at. Oh, you, 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 I mean, your children are not doing well. Oh, let, let me just leave them. No, God can make them to do Amen. well. Amen. Oh, I don't know the door. You have been looking for a job for years. There's a particular exam you have been writing. Oh, I'm tired. I don't think it is possible for me to. I want to give you, maybe because this program is because of you. This prayer session is because of you. Receive wisdom to excel. Amen. That door is opening Amen. for you. That door of the new job is opening for Amen. you. That door of that certification is opening for Amen. you. That door of success is opening for Amen. you. That door of marriage is opening for Amen. you. That door of, of promotion is opening for Amen. you. They are promoting everybody. It's like you alone. You are the only one that is not being promoted. Oh, no. I say that door is open Amen. for you. The, 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 the God that promotes <laughs> the three evil boys will promote you Amen. in the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. Look at what it says in the book of Mark, chapter 10, verse 27. Mark 10, 27. It says, But Jesus looked at them and said, With men it is it is impossible. But not with God. What a great word. He said, Jesus is not with God. For with God all Amen. things are possible. I decree doors of possibilities Amen. are opening for you. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. What seems impossible to you before? Amen. By the reason of this prayer half hour. By the reason of the anointing upon our life. I join my anointing with the anointing of my wife. Lord, by the reason of the grace of God upon our life. I speak into your life. I speak into your marriage. Amen. I speak into your circumstance. Amen. I speak into your situation. Amen. I say you door be open. Amen. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Because we are calling on the God that makes all things happen. That makes all things possible. That's the God we are praying to tonight. To 
to, to God that is able to answer us at this hour. Yes, Lord. Lord Almighty, we pray for this one under the sound of my voice. Mm. I don't know what she or he is going through, Lord mm. Almighty, but you know it. You know the Lord. door they are knocking at. Ah, Every door that has brought reproach into your life. Oh, in the mighty name of Jesus. That door, that door that has brought reproach to your life. The door refused to open, so it has become a reproach. Ah, it has become a reproach. That reproach, God is removing it. In the mighty name of Jesus. Because of your shame. Because um, instead of your shame, God is giving you double glory. Amen. Because that door is opening. Amen. I say that door is opening. Amen. The door is opening. Amen. You know why? Because we are calling on the God. Yes, Lord. That we think yes, is able to do exceeding yes. abundantly far more than what we can ask or think. Look at the book of Ephesians chapter 3. He said, now unto God. I love that. I love the way the, the, the Apostle Paul wrote that statement. He said, now to him. Now to the God. Not to the Almighty Father who is able to do the God that is able to do exceedingly and abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us. I don't know what you are asking God. Mm. God will exceed your expectation Amen. in the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Over your family, I say, God, this God will exceed your expectation Amen. in the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. This God that is working in us, this God who has called me and my wife, this God who has called us into a ministry, mm -hmm. no man put this on upon himself. Mm -hmm. No man can just put himself on where we are sitting. Mm -hmm. No, it is God, yes, and Lord. He has given us authority. He yes, said, Lord. We shall decree a thing and it shall and come to pass. We are decreeing into your life mm -hmm. according to the power of God that is at work mm -hmm. in us. I speak it into your must, situation. I speak into that door that refused to, to open. I say, You door, open. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. You dog, you dog, joblessness. Mm. Mm -hmm. Ah, be, receive your job. Amen. That dog oh, that made that has made you to become homeless. What has led you into it is because the door refused to open for you, mm. and you find yourself becoming homeless. I speak into your life. Amen. Everyone is checking your record. Mm. Your, your documents, your your record is before the, the, the most high God. And your life is being turned around. I see everything turning around in your favor. Amen. Why? Because unto him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly. Can you see the adjective? Exceedingly means infinitely. Abundantly because... That there is no lack in it. Mm. I, keep, I, I kept telling people that in the world there is famine, there is inflation, there is lack everywhere, there is complaint. But in the kingdom of God, where we belong to, there is no thing like inflation there. Amen. There is nothing like famine there. Amen. There is abundant, abundant supply. Amen. He said, my God shall supply all your needs Amen. according to his riches in glory Amen. in Christ Jesus. According to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus. Amen. In his riches, there is no lack in the kingdom of God mm. in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. I speak to that lack in your life Amen. that door of abundance is open for Amen. you in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. the door of lack is shut for you Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. I speak I speak into the life of everyone under the sound of my voice door of poverty is open is Amen. shut for you Amen. We shut the door of poverty. Amen. We shut the door of barrenness. Amen. We shut the door of, of no marriage. Amen. We shut every door of reproach. We shut it for you. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. According to the power that works in yes, us. Lord. The power of God. Mm. The, 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 the dynamis. The, the dynamis of God. The power that <laughs> the word, he, he spoke the word and it came to being. And he said, whatever he hear us speak, he will do for us. We are decreeing and God is establishing. <laughs> God is putting his mark of, of authority. He said, two shall agree concerning a thing. It shall be established in heaven. We agree Amen. together Amen. that today doors of possibilities begin to open for you. Amen. In the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. Hallelujah. What a Amen. great God we have. Hallelujah. What a mighty God Hallelujah. we are serving. <laughs> 
With God, all things are possible, yes, I'm telling Lord. you. Look at the book of Job, chapter 42, verse 2. Job, you say, I know that you can do everything. everything. Wow. I know that you can do everything. Job was, was, was talking to God. Can you, do you believe that God can do everything? I know that you can do everything. Mm. And that no purpose of yours can be withheld from you. Every purpose of God concerning your life, concerning your destiny, concerning your family, concerning your children. Oh, concerning your destiny shall not be thwarted. Amen. No, you are becoming unstoppable. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, because we know the God we are serving, mm. he can do all okay. things. He makes the impossibility possible. Mm. He's the God who can do all things. And that the purpose of your life, whatever purpose God has proposed for you, nothing can withhold it from coming Amen. to pass. Men can delay, but men cannot deny you. <laughs> oh, hear me again. Men can delay, and they have delayed you for so long. Today, by the version of this prayer, we decree an open door. Amen. In the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. We decree an open door. Amen. In the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. A new beginning has come into Amen. your life. A new beginning has come into your life. Amen. You that you have been in this land for, for many years, or only God knows when. <laughs> and you have not even gotten your paper. I wish we, we want to speak into you right now. There's what nothing God cannot God do. do. There is nothing God, God cannot do. do. There is nothing the Spirit of God cannot do. Oh, there is nothing God cannot do. We have, word of, we have come to assure you that there is nothing God cannot do. Amen. We have come, God, Jehovah. The, the Jehovah Otto can do. The one who talks and do. Mm. And send us to you. That nothing shall be impossible. Amen. Amen. I, I, I don't know the situation you are going through. You have been in this land for years. And you find it difficult. In fact, many of many of maybe maybe you have even you have planned so many things. You have tried this and tried that. We say try God now. Mm. Ah, we want you to try God. Mm -mm. Try God. Join Amen. your faith with Amen. us. As Amen. we are praying, I want you to stretch out Amen. your hand wherever you Amen. are. And Amen. we decree into your hand. Amen. We decree that that hand, Amen. you will put papers together and it shall be approved. Amen. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Your next application for your papers. I don't know what you are processing in USA or wherever. Or in Homeland Security or whatever. You have been turned down several times. This next time you are going there, favor will go with you. Amen. The grace of God will go Amen. with you. Grace will undertake Amen. it for you. And that door of impossibility will open for Amen. you. Amen. Your approval, I say receive it. Amen. Re receive your approval. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Receive that paper you are Amen. looking for. Receive that visa you are looking Amen. for. Receive it in the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. I say that door is opening Amen. for you. Oh God, God, God is addressing your matter. <laughs> For a long time, Cornelius had been doing his thing. He had been giving harm. He had been doing that. A day just came that God that brought his matter to memorial. <laughs> the day God brought his his matter to memorial, his life changed. Ah, oh, today I speak into your life. That your matter has been brought to memory Amen. from God. You remember the story of Mordecai? Mm. A night came hmm, where it was just two days for Mordecai <coughs> to be to, uh, a decree to destroy them will come. <laughs> but that night the king did not sleep. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. The king that that we put the put to shame the enemy of Mordecai. The king did not sleep. Ah, if you read the book of Esther, you will know that when you read the old book of Esther, you can see where God is written in that book. It's one of the two books that are in the Bible that you can't see the name God written there. But God was walking all through. Hmm. I want to tell you that God is walking behind the scenes of Amen. the matter. And he has sent us to come and tell you hmm. that today, 
your matter has been brought to me. Amen. And everyone is taking attention. Amen. And they say, what can we do to the one whom the, whom the king wants to favor? Mm -hmm. The one whom the king delights in. We say, heaven delights in you. Amen. And that day, what happened that night? <laughs> the king could not sleep. And by the time he woke up, he said, who is in the sitting room? Who is in the court of the king? They say, it's Ammon. <laughs> oh, he said, call him. And he asked Ammon. The Ammon wanted to destroy Mordecai. <laughs> Can you imagine that story? The Bible says in the king asks. He asks Ammon, look, what can the king do to, for the one whom he delights in? And the Bible says, Ammon thought he was the one. Hey, le, 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 le. And he said, okay, and because he had it in mind that look, okay, let the king dress up his horse, his, mm -hmm. his horse and then let, let him put him on the uh, 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 on the horse and begin to ride him around the town and begin to say, This is the one whom the king delights in. Oh, see how the table turned around. The king said, Quickly go and get Mordecai and Tracy Boom and do the same and carry him around. That is how ever we put you to put your enemies to Amen. shame. Whoever has thought that he has blocked your way, mm. that made the doors difficult for you. Now, as we are praying and speaking, we Amen. speak in faith and we decree Amen. that that your enemy, the table is being torn against Amen. that one. Hey, anyone who stand against your papers, God will Ooh, remove them. Amen. And as you apply, just join your faith with me. Because you are coming to testify. Amen. As soon as God answers, just Amen. write and say, Amen. this is confirmed. Amen. We are not speaking as men. We are speaking as the oracle of God. Amen. And we are decreeing into your matter mm. that that approval is granted. Amen. That door is open Amen. for you. In the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. I'm, talk, I'm talking of the God who opens and no man's shut. Sure. Look at the book of Revelation chapter 3. And we are closing with this scripture quickly. Hallelujah. Revelation 3 verse 7 to 8. The Bible says, And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia writes, This thing says he who is only who is true. He was the key of David. He who opens and no one shuts. And shuts and no one opens. I know your work. See, I have said before you an open door. And no one can shut it. Amen. I speak into your life. A door is open for you. Amen. God has set an open door Amen. for you. And no man can shut Amen. it for you. I mean, at that door that you have been knocking, door of marriage is open Amen. for you. A door of, of, of promotion is open Amen. for you. I say a door of elevation is open Amen. for you. A door of baby children is open for Amen. you. A, a door of progress and promotion is open Amen. for you. And so shall it be. Why? Because the key, the one who has the key of David, have opened Amen. and no man can shut Amen. it. No man will be able to shut it. Amen. No enemy will be able to shut it. A man in your life cannot shut it again. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Before we close, I quickly want to remind you. This year's conference of the, the, the Kingdom Possibility Conference, please be part of it. It's a three-day conference coming up in the, the uh, uh, September 16, 17, 18. God of possibility wants to we'll continue what this prayer we are praying god is going to do more amen. in that conference amen. in the mighty name of amen. jesus god will open doors amen. that you have been knocking for years amen. and god is going to do wonders amen. in your life amen amen, amen. pastor mrs can you just say short, short prayer Hallelujah. amen lord we can see everything, everything turning, turning around. around yes lord everything turning, turning around, around. everything Turning, turning around, around for our good. We can, can see, see everything, everything turning around. See yeah, it's turning, turning around. around. Yeah, turning, turning around, around, around for our good. Father in heaven, we Amen, thank you. Lord. 
We thank you, Father, because you are the creator of heaven and earth. Yes, Lord. And there is nothing you cannot oh, do. Oh, yes, Lord. And you've said in your word that what you hear us say, you mm -hmm. will do. Yes, Lord. We have decreed and declared mm -hmm. today yes, that Lord. things will turn around for your children in the name of Jesus. Amen, Lord. Father, we pray because you are a prayer answering God. Yes, Lord. We are asking for testimonies concerning the request of today Amen. in the name of Amen, Jesus. Amen, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. For a prayer answering God. Yes, Lord. And we've prayed in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm so excited. I want to hear from you. Because we are not just praying. We pray before we pray. <laughs> no, we don't just we don't just come up with uh, we no 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 we are inspired and God will give us the prayer points. Amen. And I know somebody is going to have testimony. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Please, we want to see you next Sunday in Faith and Grace Church. If you live around here in the city of Houston, why not just walk? We have more time to pray. And every Sunday evening we have prayer uh, uh, prayer line. You can join us. The detail of the prayer line is there on the screen. Please join us every Sunday evening between the hour of 6 and 7. Let us pray together. God has given us a commission to pray for the nation. To pray for the people. Now when we pray, God answers. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. So see you this coming Sunday. By the grace of God. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen.